What is up YouTube? Kim the Blondie here bringing you a brand new video. Today we're going to high Hrothgar and leveling up our sneak as fast as possible. The quickest way. So you equip the iron dagger and you sneak up behind one of these graybeards. Any one of them, it doesn't matter which one. And you just start wailing on them. As you can see, I already leveled up. I leveled up again. Like, look at that. I'm just going up like crazy. It's just like non-stop. Now, I do know once you get up higher to like level 90 and stuff, it does slow down. I think the slowest is between 90 and 100. And that is the slowest time. And also, I would highly recommend, do not create anything that increases your dagger damage. Because as you can see, I'm doing very little damage. So it, it increases the time. Now, you definitely want to make sure you save in between spurts because if you get detected and you hit them they're going to become hostile start attacking you and you have to reload the save and you do not want to go from say 50 to 80 and then have to do it all over again because you didn't save now there is also another place it's not as fast but you can level up your archery as you're doing it this way you level up one-handed weapons uh, skill and it's very very slow I don't know if I have anything going I level up in this clip but the other way it's not as fast on sneak but you do level up your archery instead of one handed weapon anyways so you want to go to dragon's reach and white run and be sure to have your bow out and come up over here sneak of course and now my sneak is pretty high. You want to make sure you're stacked up on iron arrows. Um, that's basically what I had. Now my sneak is pretty high. I wasn't for sure if this person would spot me, but he never did. So I just went ahead and started going. You just basically shoot the y'all with arrows. You just keep doing it until you know he goes down. Um, make sure you don't want to. You definitely do not want to get detected because then you will. Uh, you get spotted you have to reload the save um, as before you definitely want to save now I wait an hour so he gets his health back now this kind of messed up here I waited too long to wait an hour and so he was stuck on the ground the entire time he got his health back but he was stuck on the ground and that's kind of annoying see I tried to wait another hour and it didn't help it just gave him back his health so basically, as soon as he loses his health and he's about to drop to the ground, you want to wait an hour. He should stand back up and then he's got all his health back. So basically, you just keep doing this and yeah, I wasn't for sure. I waited for him to stand up, get, got his health back. Now, he does move around as you can see. He, he will eventually sit up from the throne and sometimes he'll go back to sit down after a little bit sometimes he won't so there is a likely chance that you will miss and if you don't have a sure shot like archery a really good archery shot if you're not real well with it it's gonna take quite a bit but as I said you want to make sure you keep iron, uh, you have stacked up iron arrows you just keep doing this, basically the same thing. Like I said, it's a lot slower, but it works. And then at the end, you can run up and get any of the iron arrows that you missed. Typically. I know after a while they despawn. Um, but I'm going to drop it off here and let the gameplay keep playing for you so you can check it out. If you like the video, please leave a thumbs up. It's always appreciated. Also, highly, highly, highly appreciated that subscribe button getting hit. Anyway, today has been a lovely day. I hope you guys have a lovely day. I'll see you in the next video. Peace! May the gods watch over your battles, friend. What is it that you need?